Hi, my name is Omari Mack. I'm a math tutor, and today we'll talk about the relationship between perimeter and area. Now, the basic relationship is that any one side change of a shape will determine both area and perimeter. So let's compare two rectangles, the first being a 3 by 5. Now if you want the perimeter, I would get um, 3 over here since opposite sides are equal, and 5 down here since opposite sides are equal. The perimeter for this, adding up all the sides, 5 plus 5 is 10, and 3 plus 3 is 6, so 10 plus 6 would be 16. The area. I'm going to go ahead and multiply the length and the width, 3 times 5, is 15. Now let's say I change a dimension. Let's make the width 4 now and the length 5. Now the perimeter is going to be, once again, opposite sides are equal. The perimeter would be 5 plus 5 is 10, 4 plus 4 is 8, so the perimeter is 18. So we see the change between 16 and 18. The area would be 4 times 5, which is 20. And of course, the area is in square units as well. So that's the relationship between area and perimeter. A change in any side measure is going to affect both area and perimeter. Thank you for watching.